Hello everyone, today I'm reconvening my last play of Dragon Age Inquisition. I'm still stuck in the character creation screen. I made headway, I'm now customizing the mouth and the jaw. I need to select my mouth shape. There's a vast amount of options. Hopefully I could choose correctly. I do not want to make any blunders. I want my character to look impeccable in all facets. My character is going to put on a modern gig for the NPCs in the Dragon Age universe. I need to be prepared. I always second guess myself. It's a bad habit of mine. Some of my habits are appalling. I need to abstain from second guessing myself. I just stick with my decisions. I'll likely never finish the game. I'll likely scarcely encounter my character's face. Should I contract my mouse or expand it? I guess I'll keep the mouse as close to the chin as possible. Oh, my character to look lush, radiant, vibrant, and majestic. I'm just contemplating if I should contract my jaw or expand it. It's hard just to make a decision. I'm extremely indecisive. I guess I'll contract it. The jowls. Alright, I need to customize the chin size. It's too bad you cannot change your appearance later on in the game. What a shame. Now I need to change my chin shape. No, I do not want a double chin. I don't I don't want that either. I'm just contemplating whether I should remove my chin completely. Does that look better? Is this one option? I don't want my character's face to look fat.
Got rid of the chin. That looks completely awkward. Alright, I need to remove the double chin. I guess this appearance will have to suffice for now. Unless I change my mind later. Scars. Scars give your own custom character. More character. Scars to know that your character is an ardent warrior. Scars to know that he has been in the fray battle. Scars to know that your face has been marred from the enemy's blade. You can modify your skin intensity. This is quite a lot to take in. You can change your eyeshadow color. I guess so. Amplify my eyeshadow intensity to the highest possible degree. I can change my under eye color. It's a unique feature. I can also customize my under eye brow intensity or under brow intensity. The eyelash color can be changed as well as the eyeliner color in conjunction with modifying those colors. You can also modify your eye liner intensity. I've never seen such an intricate customization option for a single character before. All this customization is just obsessive on my behalf. I wonder if I should just go with this build. I selected my race, my class, and my appearance. I 
I'm just not at ease with my selection of my character's chin. I prefer the longer chin as opposed to the shorter chin, so I guess this appearance will have to suffice. It's able to suit my niche desires. I've tailored my character to appear as I planned. He kind of looks demonic, to say the least. Maybe I should change my eyeshadow intensity. Let's go back to the makeup option in funnel time. Let's see what happens. I prefer the more artificial look with the eyeshadow intensity on the maximum degree. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for another stupendous part of my Dragon Age Inquisition Let's Play.